Good, good afternoon everyone and welcome to the latest video from B-Cycle Videos and today I am at Cholsey which is on the Great Western Main Line. So today here at Cholsey we'll be seeing services from Great Western Railway and Cross Country. The, the, fir the first two services we saw on, on, on this side we saw 387132 on one, and 387135. They were on the 1619 service from London Paddington to Digcock Parkway. And on the other side is the other 1539 service that's heading to D London Paddington from Digcock Parkway. That was 387, 148 and 387, 157. And that's heading to London Paddington. Pa passing through now, through now on platform two, is a service from Morton in Marsh to London Paddington. Eight hundred three one five, possibly. I think it's eight eight hundred three one five. And, and that and that's on a service from Morton in Marsh to London Paddington. Like jo joining me here at Chelsea is Trainspotty. So please do check check out his channel. He makes some excellent content, and uh, and is definitely worth a watch. So without further ado, let's get started, shall we? Let's get started here at Chelsea. Right, passing through now is a service from Swansea to London Paddington. Right, passing through now is a Great Western Railway service from London Paddington to Bristol Park, Bristol Temple Mead, sorry. 43040 and 43070 43040 and 070 heading to Bristol Temple Mead on on the delayed pass originating from London Paddington I think about 40 minutes late passing like passing through now Two twenty zero two six, I think it is. I think I think Kevin was right in the, when we did before. I think it is two twenty zero two six. That's a cross country service from Reading to Newcastle. Calling next at Oxford. Right, passing through now is a cross country service from Newcastle to Reading. Okay, next up is a cross country pass heading to Reading, Newcastle. Reading its next and final stop. Four, it, pass through. Like passing through on the slow lines. And 221140 is a it's a deformed 221. 221140 heading for Reading. Just note this is deformed 221. Right, coming okay, in down there. Like so passing through down there is a Great Western Railway service to Great Malvern, which is a turbo service. Great Malvern, it is going to be. It's 165114. 165 to Great Malvern. That was doing Dig Digcot to Oxford it, services earlier. Also coming in is the 1607 service. To London Paddington, three eight seven one three five and three eight seven one three two, coming back around. Also, in the distance, I can see a passing Bristol Temple Mead service. About seven minutes or so late, six or seven minutes late. I can see that in the distance. So I'm going to keep running. So let, let's see it through this fenced bit. 
but when it does pass through Eight hundred zero one two, I think it is. Well, well, just passing out three eight seven one three five and three eight seven one three two. That's heading out to London Paddington. Meanwhile, I can also see another service that's about to pass through. That's going to be the 1608 pass heading to London Paddington this time. No, that's to, to Bristol Temple Mead, sorry, right, from London again. Paddington. Eight hundred double oh nine and eight hundred zero ten. They're heading to Bristol Temple Meads from London Paddington. Right, com coming in now is the 1611 Great Western Railway Service heading for Digcock Parkway, a service from London Paddington. We're Digcock Parkway after this, after, after here at Chelsea being its next and final stop. Once again, as always, it's been it's a double pairing of class three eight sevens. Three eight seven one six seven. What was was it with one three three earlier? Oh, oh. Like ah, oh, three one three eight seven one six seven. Definitely on it. I I, I, I thought we saw, saw it earlier, but I'm, I may be mistake mistaking myself. But anyway, I'll, I will catch the uh, the unit on the rear as it departs. Right, departing out now is three eight seven one six seven. And three eight seven one thirty. They're on the sixteen eleven to Digcock Parkway. One stop down the line. Right about to pass through now is a service from Oxford to London Paddington. Again, it's an 800, I think it's a five carriage. Right, storming through down there is a Great Western Railway service from London Paddington to Swansea, formed of a double pairing of class 800s. I just, just had a, a good bit, bit of wonder because I did, I did see, like just, just over there on platform one, there, there is a like a Mini waiting room with steps down to down to the underpass and underneath the station. But but it's actually there, there's a locked gate. So down down in the underpass. So so you can't actually get to platform one and platform two. You you use the underpass heading to this this platform platform three where they're standing on at, at the minute. But you can't actually access platform 2 either. 
Platform three is where we're standing on at the minute. Platform four for stopping services to London Paddington and platform five though doesn't seem to be have been used in ages even though there is a platform sign there the tracks does do seem to go off, off out off elsewhere away from from the from these four lines right coming around now is a cross-country passing service from from Southampton Airport Park Grade to Manchester Piccadilly that was a 221131 yeah 221131 passing through with a service to Manchester Piccadilly originating from Southampton Airport Parkway next stop Oxford Right, soon to pass through down there in the distance is a Great Western Railway service from Cheltenham Spa to London Paddington. It's a Class 800 service, or possibly an 802, can't, can't remember which. Eight hundred zero eleven, possibly. Eight hundred zero eleven, heading from Cheltenham Spa to London Paddington. Passing through now, we've got two passes. One from Man London Paddington to Oxford, the other Manchester Piccadilly to Southampton Airport Parkway. That's four. That's four coaches. De that's def definitely four coaches oh, okay. across so country. Like suspect two twenty zero two one. Kevin I'm does sure. for that cross country services, yeah, but not not completely sure. And zero two nine, you say to Oxford eight hundred eight two nine to Oxford eight zero two double o nine. Like departing out now, 387.130 and 387.167 with the 16.37 to London Paddington. And, and apologies, it seems in, the last clip so, suddenly cut, cut out on me because I, when, when, when I wasn't expecting it. Come, come, coming in now is the 16.39, the other way heading towards Didcot Parkway. Again, a double pairing of class 387s. And we're, we've been wondering if we've seen this pairing before, her, earlier at, at Tilehurst when we started. 387155. 387155, so 387144 on the rear. So, yes, we have seen this pairing of units before. So, so once again, these pe these units are come, start are starting to come back around. But here, three eight seven one five five and one five no one four four. Like right, departing out is the sixteen thirty nine to Dickot Parkway. Three eight seven double pairing units one five five and one four four. 387-155-387-144 They're heading one final stop to Dickot Parkway Calling it Dickot Parkway only Right next to the pass through is a service from Great Malvern to London Paddington. Go, yeah, I think I think this might be one we saw at at, at Tilehurst earlier. I think. I'm I'm not certain, but I think we saw this at Tilehurst earlier.
800s and I think 314. 800, 314, I'd say it is. I just want to mention, 800, was the one that was delayed, basically. It was the one that was delayed. Right, passing through now is a HST service from London Paddington. No, it's heading to London Paddington, a service originating from Swansea. One, one, two, two on the front. Four, forty-three, one, two, two on the front, and so, and on the rear. Like, did 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 you catch what's on the rear, Kevin? Zero nine seven. Zero, zero nine seven on the rear. Like, we again, we did we did saw see. Again, yes, yeah, saw saw this at Tilehurst earlier again. Right, passing through is an IET to Cheltenham Spa. Eight hundred three one seven. That's the service to Cheltenham Spa, and 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 that's what like when when I was at Swin, Swindon back in November. 800-317 was the unit that I caught heading back to Newport. 800-317. That, that may call it Dickot next, or it may go faster Swindon, I'm not quite sure. No, that they call Dickot Dick, Dick, yeah. Dick Swindon, I think Stonehouse, Stroud, Kendall. Oh no, it's Kendall. No, Kendall, Stroud, Stonehouse, Gloucester, Gloucester and Cheltenham. Right, passing through now is a cross-country service from Reading to Newcastle. That, that must be the 221120 coming back. Was it one? Yeah, I think it is 120 coming back. Yeah. That's a cross country service from Reading to Newcastle. Right, about, about to pass through now okay, is the final train of this yeah, video, and it's a cross country passing service from Newcastle yeah, to Reading. And as many have this day, it's a cross country pass along. The slow relief lines, which is something I'd expect, like ki kind of expect, because like with his because they get like these cross country services go via Oxford and they use the Didcot North Junction, so slight slightly avoiding Didcot Parkway to to North. Like not north of Blackburn Five, where like with, like the fast services use platforms one one and two, and the slower services use platforms three, four, five. Passing through, two twenty zero, two twenty double three. That's the pass stop heading to Reading. So as that passes through, we, we're going to end up our videos here from here at Chelsea. Thank you, thank you guys for watching my video from Chelsea. If you have liked what you've seen here at Chelsea, then please do like and subscribe. Please leave any comments below because I'll get back to them as and when I can. Any recommendations are welcome, so please do leave them in the comments. Like Chelsea, but once again, it's been a great station to film at. Like oh, probably of the four stations today, it's uh, it's uh, certainly been my my favourite to to film at today, along with Pangborn. But Chelsea, I'll probably say, ju ju just about edges it with, with the amazing views he heading down down the line to to Digcot and the other way back back to Reading.
and that that's the and that's despite the fence here, here separating platforms two and three and the large amount of rubbish that's just being disposed on the other on the other side of the gate of of these metal fencings it's like of, of, of the four stations, Chelsea definitely tops it. I say Pang Pangbon comes second, and then the and then the other two. I'd say probably come 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 and join, join third for lack for lack of a definite de for lack of a definite position between them. Join, joining me here at Chelsea was Train Spotty, so please do check out his channel. He makes some fantastic videos, so please do check out his. So please do check out his stuff. Like what looks like coming coming through now is a great Western Railway service from Bristol Temple Mees to London Paddington. So I'm going to catch it before I finish up for the day. For 43, 196 and 43, 185. So as that passes through, I'm going to finish up. So see you in my next video. In the meantime, thank you guys for watching my video from Chelsea. See you next time.